All right, y'all, coming in hot, man. We got to talk about the dad gum, what's going on right now in this world. It is so crazy. And this is why it's so important, man. Y'all that don't vote, you need to go get registered, boy. You need to go get registered. Because I want you to see what's going on, right? Right now in Mexico, now the fake news won't show you this. CNN, ABC, NBC, MSNBC, none of them will show you. But what's happening in Tijuana right now is an outrage by the people. They're demanding, the, the Mexican citizens are demanding something be done from their government because they have been invaded by these Central Americans that think they're going to come up here and rush the border. They, I'm watching them. They're doing interviews on them. They're screaming. These people, there's a whole bunch of protesters from Mexico that have formed, and they're protesting against these people being in their city because they're trashing it. They're ungrateful. They're disrespectful. These people offer them food. They... They, com they don't have no food, no pot to piss in, but they're going to complain about the food that people's giving them. We don't like it. Are you giving me a... I mean, what? You're starved to damn death, then. Crimes overrunning the city. Gangs are in there now. The Mexican people were screaming, Donald Trump's right. Donald Trump's right. It's an invasion. So, I'm telling you, don't be fooled by this fake news. Don't let them fool you. They try to pull your attention away from what's really going on. That's why you need to watch and pay attention to this border crap. There's 7,000 of them piled up right now in Tijuana trying to get over here. All right. Donald Trump's doing everything he can to secure our country and protect our sovereignty. All right. So he, he has this thing passed where well, if you're going to come in our country illegally, you're not going to be able to file for asylum. Well, some clown in Obama appointee in the ninth district or whatever it is uh, of San Francisco, a judge has the power to override the president. And I, I to me, that is crazy. It, I mean, we, that is a broken system that must be fixed. This man is jeopardizing the lives of no telling how many people right now by doing that. All it's doing is just taking time. It'll have to be appealed. It'll go to the Supreme Court, and all this is going to take time. Meanwhile, it's putting a strain on the men and women of the Border Patrol. Uh, it's putting their lives in extreme danger. Uh, if this crowd decides to rush over, I mean, you know, this judge is going to have tremendous amount of blame to do if something bad happens. And it just, it, it appalls me to think that one man can have that much control over this country. Uh, and he's not even the president. He wasn't even elected by the people. He was appointed by Obama. So uh, we need to wake the hell up, man. We do. We need to look and see what's going on around us. Don't listen to the fake news, baby. Trump's trying to do what's best for America, and these people is trying to blackball him for it. Roll tight and God bless.